In this circuit we're looking at how you can use the infrared wireless transmitter and receiver okay to introduce uh, wireless into um, uh, your circuits okay so the receiver um, it has uh, uh, three parts to it it has um, an input voltage which um, in my case um, that's five volts it also has um, a ground and it has um, a signal wire okay so we've connected a signal wire here to um, on the actual mic controller itself, it's pin 14, which corresponds to digital pin 8. Okay, and then I have this uh, um, LED uh, circuit, and that's connected to, um, um, on the chip itself, it's, uh, it's pin 13, which uh, corresponds to digital pin 7. Okay, so when you click any of these buttons on, the, uh, on this uh, transmitter here, um, it corresponds to an eight digit code. So once you know um, the eight digit code, all you then, you know, you just put in an if sta statement and say, you know, if it if it receives this eight digit code, um, you want it to um, do something. In this case, we want, well, when I click one, we want it to uh, turn this LED on. When I click two, um, I want to turn this LED off, okay? So we will see, um, when you look at the code, you will see that um, when I press, um, uh, number one, it corresponds, the act the digit code is 165A2903 and uh, number two corresponds, the digit, uh, it's a digit code is 166-15543, okay? So once you've got all that then it's it's actually really, it's a really good way of, um, you know, you can switch um, lots of different things on and off and so forth, okay? And that's it. So okay, when I press 1, you can see that the LED turns on. When I press 2, you can see that the LED turns off. So the circuit um, works. Okay.